Hello, uh, this is Pavel from RunQuiz. Today we um, release a new update for our PBN manager. PBN is uh, without a doubt essential part of current state of ACO and um, everyone who does um, ACO seriously nowadays on uh, some um, self-hosted domains and uh, grow them and monitor them for the ACO needs for they or ACO client needs. Um, some people are getting scared of uh, lately of the war itself, PBN, um, uh, the dropping down to almost to whisper, it's like uh, something illegal. Um, but if you think like five years ago, we all were looking for property to place links. So that's like we're speaking about uh, uh, ACO, the part of ACO that is uh, link building. We were all looking for uh, property to place the link um, nowadays, it's switching more and more owning those properties uh, um, because um, because uh, link can be positive and negative value, and even more, the positive link can become a negative. Uh, uh, the positive value link can over time become negative. It's uh, becoming more and more starting standard procedure of building your own properties. Uh, growing them, m monitor, like monitoring is essential because um, you want to make sure before you're placing your links or for yourself or your clients so that it is of the mm, uh, high authority. And then you use uh, those uh, PBNs for your own SEO uh, purposes. Um, we introduced uh, our PBN manager um, a uh, little uh, while ago, and uh, it's it's been a, uh, a lot of success. A lot of users are switching to use um, our um, monitoring for PBNs, and this is the current state of PBN monitoring in Branquis. You can uh, monitor ACO profiles, um, various ACO metrics. You can monitor backlinks. Uh, so we have backlinks monitor. Um, you can uh, uh, use rank tracker and uh, those those top three do not require the PBN plugin but PBN plugin itself with PBN plugin itself installed in WordPress you can uh, uh, see all the alerts and updates for plugins themes uh, core itself, uh, update them from one location, managing posts, comments, pages, and so on. So this is the current state of uh, um, SEO monitoring on run quiz. And to demonstrate, I'm switching over to one of the networks, uh, the one of the projects I have in run quiz. And you can see that it has a main site, it has uh, multiple tier networks, and it has some stats. And I'm switching over to a network that has a type of private block network. And again, so there are like overview, there are uh, different um, uh, stats and posting stats, but I'm switching to blogs and go to one of my blogs. This is all hosted, um, that's typical PBN site. And this is how it looks in RunQuiz when you uh, enable, um, when you add your PBN or self-hosted site. So we track all metrics, page rank, index pages, uh, most ranks, uh, domain authority, page authority, we track uh, majestic uh, uh, metrics, and does not all that's not just for your information. It's al also actionable, so you can um, every time uh, um, there is a drop of any of your metrics, you will see an alert, uh, and you can act on this. This is really important to see when uh, some qualities of your. Uh, mm, uh, hosts uh, of the PBN sites are dropping. Um, so ACO profile, this is more extended uh, version of the metrics we capture. Uh, we uh, aggregate them from uh, multiple link aggregation sites. And, uh, and again, they all you know, trackable over time and uh, should any of them start dropping, you will see an alert. Backlinks monitor, uh, 
you can see all new and lost backlinks and again it's critical for PBN to monitor this um, not only you can see results as you see backlinks as as a result of uh, your effort you also can see if uh, there's any negative as your campaign launched or um, basically uh, uh, your goal is to maintain a uh, steady uh, length building velocity the spike on the drop uh, spike on the lost links is a negative factor for the uh, link uh, link uh, profile next would be rank tracker and again so i don't need to explain how important rank tracker for aco uh, metrics but we also use it in a different context as indicating um, basically if Google decided or Google or being uh, as a search engine decided to place your site for the specific keyword um, in the search engine this is ultimate indication of authority of recognition from the search engine and as a result, we have uh, so-called SERP pipes when you can filter out based on the uh, your networks, based on the, either the ranking or not ranking. Our rank tracker, by the way, is um, unique, also unique in a way that we scrape, uh, we monitor results up to five, six hundred positions. So basically, you can you can see uh, not only a one year PBN is in the top 10 or top 20, which is critical for your money side. So you want to have your mind side uh, to be in the top top position. But PBN, just the fact that it's ranking in the uh, position, even if it's not too high, it's just a sign of uh, authority for the specific keyword. Um, and uh, PBN manager itself, that's required to install the plugin. So what you can see here, you can see the alerts when the plugin, a uh, new version of plugin theme is available. You can uh, ignore, you can uh, run an update right from the from the run quiz. You can see recent posts. You can uh, manage comments, pages. You can create new posts. Um, you can switch over to a WordPress dashboard and uh, see um, the dashboard itself without leaving, without uh, logging into the, into the, uh, to the, to the WordPress itself. So this is, uh, this is a quick summary of the current state of what we already had in RunQuiz. And now to the, the updates we are releasing today, the PBN, uh, so PBN Manager 2.0, let's call it this way. First is the uptime monitor. Uh, extremely, extremely critical for the when you run many sites, when you deploy in the uh, cheap uh, hosting uh, to you know, drop any you know, footprint of that. Uh, they all sites belong to the same owner. Mm, you want to see uh, uh, the, the status of all of your PBN sites. You want to receive downtime alerts. You view uh, you view load time, uh, average load time because it's uh, essential. Um, uh, SEO uh, criteria nowadays, the, the speed of the site. And when you select, let's say, cheap hosting, sometimes uh, um, the, the speed load uh, might be deteriorating. So in a continue to continue example, so there's a new tab for uptime monitor. So, and uh, you can see the uh, graphs uh, for the this is by default for the last uh, last hour. You can see the response time. You can switch over to the um, last day, seven days a month, uh, custom range. So basically you can briefly see the performance of your site and you can see that this is not the best hosting, that is cheap hosting. And as a result, so sometimes uh, the response times is decent, sometimes it's slow and uh, you you should be able to set up criteria at what point you think that speed low the low speed um, page loading uh, start affecting your site negatively you also see alerts when the site goes up and down and again it's uh, you can see it's for the every site separately or you can see it in alert box you can see that site is down 
and you can switch over to and see that those are downtime for between for one check and and again it happens uh, if it happens once so it's not a big deal but if it's just uh, happens several times a day so it might be some uh, some information you will be acting on um, and uh, you um, you can enable if you go to the block self-hosted block settings you can enable uptime monitor and uh, the system will automatically start uh, checking the, you know, the checking the status uh, every five minutes and the next one is pbn analytics um we 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 often often uh, neglect the, the fact that it's nice to see the analytics but because we now switch from one side to 20 or 30 so it's it's not as easy to track the uh, combined analytics and see the uh, overall improvements in the mm, uh, over over uh, mm, your PBN and this is the attempt what we did so you can view visitors page views you can incoming links and referral domains. You can see the popular content. You can see broken links. This is important, broken links and missing pages because um, typical PBN comes from expired domain and um, you will be able to see if there's a traffic still coming to the pages that are missing and you can act on to capture the traffic and might be redirect or recreate this page. You can see the geo details and where the traffic is coming in form. You have uh, browser information, browser information, but also is what you can see because this is uh, we target PBN specifically. You can see the analytics for the whole mm, uh, network as a group. So like, let's say that uh, analytics is one of the uh, metrics you can uh, use to measure the effectiveness of your mm, effort. So you promote, let's say 30 sites and while it's it's uh, good to see uh, analytics and visitors and page views for each site specifically sometimes it's just you need a glance to see that overall page views are growing or number of visitors are coming and growing and for that I'm switching back to the Branquiz uh, PBN manager and there's a new special tab for uh, visitors and this is analytics you can see number of visitors, number of actions performed. You can see the graphs per four page views. You can see the incoming links. You can filter it out them by referral domains. Um, you can see most popular content, uh, uh, geo information by the country where the traffic is coming from, or by browser. So basically, it gives you um, information on what um, how your site is performing and when you switch to the network level you can see uh, combined analytics per network so that's, uh, that's interesting the data is just uh, because we just activated the data is start collecting for the few hours but over time you can see filters to see the last 24 hours last seven days month and the custom range so basically you can um, it's it's obviously not a competitor to full-blown analytics but it's uh, when you have 30 or 50 PBNs to to track so it's good alternative when you can see quickly in one place of how your sites are performing you have a tab for missing pages and this is where you can see that mm, where the uh, calls are made to the pages that do not exist so this is what I tested. So I created, uh, let's say, a call. The so I'm switching back to the to, to the side. And let's say I want to call the page that does not exist. And you can see 404. So that's basically what happened when you um, acquire the expired domain and you don't know if any of existing backlinks are still bringing traffic to the to the uh, to the domain to the host and switching to the uh, PBN you can see the uh, missing page non existing page over time you will see them accumulated uh, by popularity of how many which page is missing like uh, the how uh, the to the resource that brings most of the traffic 
And now switching back to new features and uh, the last one would be um, extremely critical is scheduled and manual backups. So we, um, we deployed our sites on a variety of, on, a, on a, each, each on a separate hosting. So we run them separately, they chip, they can go up and down. If you, you don't want to have even chance to lose your work, so you need to do a remote backup. Obviously there are like there are a lot of options for doing backups. So we, we thought that uh, we'll give you one more um, is to, since you already have your domains and run quiz, so you can uh, enable and uh, uh, back, up, back them up on our servers. So it's one click backup or scheduled backup. You don't need to do anything. Uh, it will be backed up every night automatically on our server. You can download your backup. You can restore your backup. You can create a, a snapshot. Snapshot is the, uh, the version of backup that will be retained uh, indefinitely until you delete it. So basically, if you do any major migration, if you just install, so you can mark any uh, regular backup as a snapshot, and then it will be retained and not delete. Otherwise, uh, the, the backups uh, will be held on the server for uh, uh, 10 days. And uh, this is uh, to demonstrate, this is another PBN, and I have installed several subdomains. Um, and if I switch to PBN manager, Go backups. So it just started, so no backups. I click backup now. And uh, because this is new, small WordPress, it comes almost immediately, but if you, um, it might take longer, but this is how it looks. So you will be, um, we, you, you don't need to do any configuration. It will be stored on our server. You can download any time. But uh, once you enable PBN Manager, you can have a peace of mind because all of your PBNs will be automatically backed up uh, on our server. You can restore with one click. So you click restore and any version of previous version will be restored. And you can also do a snapshot. Let's say if you run multiple backup, you can see there are two backups. And uh, if uh, for some reason you want some, some critical backup to be retained for a longer period of time and you want to identify it, you uh, make it a snapshot, let's say before. And let's say you want to have a backup before a major update and uh, that will be marked as a snapshot and it will not be removed unless you remove it uh, from the site. So basically over time you can create uh, multiple snapshots and keep them for longer than uh, a base uh, retention, uh, retention period. So this is to summarize of the changes we introduced. Uh, so in addition to SEO profiles, Uh, backlinks monitor, rank tracker. You have full-blown PBN manager where you can do remote control of all your updates, pages, comments. Um, you can see um, pretty decent analytics. And because it uses PBN, I, I forgot to mention, because it's using PBN, meta, PBN plugin, there's no footprint w whatsoever. So like you don't have any uh, footprint that will indicate that those two sites belong to the same, to the same owner. Um, and um, uptime monitor and uh, backups. So this is if you're running uh, uh, multiple uh, PBNs, uh, multiple PBN sites, or even multiple PBNs for yourself or your clients. Uh, this is a great addition to, to run quiz. And uh, another great point that's all coming with no extra charge. So if you have your um, plan for, uh, let's say, uh, 15 or 30,000 uh, po posting credits, so you will keep this all. And in addition, you will have um, PBN manager you can install on your PBN sites. You can monitor rank tracker and uh, basically have all the control of, over your 
uh, SEO properties from one place. Uh, thank you for watching and thank you for using Runquiz.